Well, good morning, good morning. At least it's good morning for me. Whatever it is for you when you're watching this, then uh, good day, good evening, whatever it is, good afternoon. Anyways, it's Saturday morning for me. And uh, I am just getting uh, rolling here in Steinbach, Manitoba at our terminal. Just picked up my preloaded trailer. And we got ourselves a really nice trip again. Yeah, I'm really happy about that. I had certainly uh, used the extra miles before Christmas, you know. And, well, I guess we'll be heading into warmer weather. I, at least I think it will be warmer than what it is here in Manitoba. I know it's not really cold here right now. I know when you're watching this, it will be a week from today, but uh, it might be different then, you know. But today it certainly isn't uh, isn't bad at all. Today is uh, December 13, I believe. Yep, that's it. I got a calendar up there. That's why I look up there. And here we go. Just getting out of the gate here at Penners. Yep. Got uh, 2,620 uh, kilometers to go. Now that's a nice trip. That's about two and three quarter day of, day of driving. So we should be there Monday evening. And they expect us to deliver to the do the delivery on Tuesday. Turn left on. Bay Which shouldn't Street, be any problem, right? 52, and then slide right into the At least I don't meters. think so. Yep. We'll get it rolling towards the border. Crossing uh, Rosal today again. I'm actually surprised with the slow that I picked up here. It's coming out of Yorkton, Saskatchewan. And it's uh, Oats. General Mill Oats and usually these loads are very heavy very heavy usually these guys they have a tendency to uh, make it so heavy because I have a heavier truck that I can't even really legally haul it and today I'm even able to haul it legally it actually says 42,000 on the paperwork which I know that's usually not correct they Generally, they say they loaded 44,000 and it's like 46,000. So, uh, if that's the case, I might be 44,000 right now. <laughs> but, Hannes does have a scale here in the yard and I did scale it. And we are legal to go. We are 34,000 on the drives and 12,000 on the steering and uh, 32,000 on the trailer. Yeah, we're actually 2,000 pounds or just about 2,000 pounds lighter than than we can be for the United States. Yeah, the roads are pretty massive. Road 14 kilometers. Yeah, that's all right. I guess we'll have to wash the truck again once we get further south where the roads are dry. I washed it just before I went out, but. If I drove one mile down the road and it almost looked the same, well not, not almost, but it was pretty salty again, but at least I got most of the salt off of there that I picked up in Ontario on my way back home, you know. Anyways, we'll keep a roll in here and then uh, we'll see you down the road. I hope you're joining me on my journey. We just had ourselves a little bit of a pit stop in the Swan River, Minnesota. Had me a bite to eat. And now we are going to go back on the roads. Yeah. Just gotta do a little bit of a stop here. I almost forgot to mark down my logbook here. I just remembered. <clears throat> gotta mark it when I leave right and I come back on to driving As we are running paper logs so we gotta do that but here we go I don't know 
know why it has been lately like that, but lately I keep forgetting to do that. I don't know why. But, oh well. Just remember that again, so. So caught it on time before I went back on the street, right? That's all that matters, I suppose. But here we go. We'll get back on the highway here as soon as we can, and then we'll be rolling. Getting some miles behind us. We got 1,340 miles to go yet, so yeah, that's going to be a nice trip. Yeah, and it's nice and warm too, like it's uh, not even supposed to go to zero, uh, zero or below zero here overnight, like, like that's Celsius, so. we make it today I would have liked to, to make it up to Black River Falls Wisconsin but I doubt it very much that that's gonna happen tonight I don't really feel very good today so I I don't think I'll be driving that late tonight I mean, it's only 3 30 here right now but uh, yeah I'll see if I can at least do another 140 miles of driving today and then I'll be done because then I know for sure I can make it in the next two days because that's only 1200 miles then I can do 600 miles a day especially if I get up early tomorrow morning and uh, get going and I should have no problem getting that done so well the day has come to an end for me and I stopped a little bit earlier than I would have actually liked to, but uh, the reason for that is uh, I am super tired today and it is uh, really foggy out there and stuff like that. So I figured, ah, uh, yeah, it's better for me to just pull off the road and call it a day and go to bed and get up early tomorrow morning and continue on tomorrow this low don't have to be there till Tuesday at 9 a.m. anyway so not really in a big hurry anyway so you know what just call it a day I'll go straight to bed I, I am just tired I don't know I didn't sleep good last night for some reason stayed up a little bit late working on my uh, son's uh, toy that he's got to build for a project for a school and uh, was working on that quite late there last night so then I went to bed and for some reason I woke up early in the morning and I couldn't fall asleep again so yeah well I figured oh, I'm tired so I'm just gonna call it a day and be done with it and go to bed and get some extra sleep and we'll be good to go tomorrow I hope so with that, I thank you guys for joining my day, for joining my uh, show, and uh, thank you for subscribing. And I guess we'll see you guys again tomorrow at 5 a.m.